Hi everybody else, audience or friends of Fake Talk. Yeah, long time no see, and I have to say, Happy Chinese New Year. Yeah, uh, we didn't, we didn't uh, make a new video for almost one week, huh? And um, yes, uh, again, this is English, uh, English versions for a fake talk and uh, because uh, we already did a Cantonese or Chinese versions of this products preview at Toys TV uh, prototype preview Yun Yun Balo. so this time I will be in English and yeah actually this this prototypes have been shown in FOF first four figures own websites or you know blog but uh, it didn't been you know been shooted uh, by third party, you know, by Rhino, right? Yeah. So this is a this is a video preview from Toys TV Rhino, and this is a different scoop to have a look on this. Okay, this is a you know the new series. It's a really new brand new series from FOF First Four Figures. You know they are famous and very keen in making big scale or big size statue, but this time. Yeah, maybe the successful experience of Link of Zelda or or or, or, or the or the or, I forgot the name of the, the wolf. Uh. Um, they continue to make this, you know, um, comparatively low price series compared to their original statue series. This is uh, I think is I as I can remember is is about eighty five US dollar. So uh, this is another another price range here yeah? it's good for you know um, I mean you know new collectors um, or games fans to collect because the price is really friendly not too not too high price right you know for a statue it's almost 400 US dollar sometimes or maybe higher it depends on the details difficulties size and the licenses but this one is, you know, below 85 US. So, I think it's a, another good choice for the collectors, especially the young collectors. You know, the the form is, you know, deformed one. So I think uh, this is this format is quite popular and quite welcomed by you know young collectors. Yeah, because this is you know deformed, look very cute. Uh, Regarding the size proportion is I think it's one to one head to bodies is one to one scale But you can see the details of the body They didn't ignore the details. It's still very details and the size of the body's neck and hands proportion is not Not completely a, a, a deformed one uh, looks like a young child but the head part the head proportion in a really big one i would say this is look like a, like a funko pop style products so this is a high quality statue you can see by the paintings detail of the structures and the difficulties of the productions so this one is a i think it's a high price compared to the funko pop style you know funko pop style is about us 20 us each so it's completely different and you could see the details, you know, the effect, the purple effect, transparent effect. And uh, don't forget to see the the details and paintings of the armors. Oh, I forgot the name. Yeah, this is Dark. This is Artorias from Dark Soul, the Abuse Watcher, the Abuse Walker, not Watcher. Sorry. And you can see the sword. The sword detail is very good. You know. This is not like a you know um, a low price, you know, low price items, low price vinyl doors. No, it is made of PVC and they say it is eight inches PVC statue. And this is only the first one in a series. Uh, as far as I know, there's already two or three on the production line. So you will see another characters from this eight inches PVC statue very soon. As I remember, it's also from Dark Soul. Yeah, so 
stay tuned for more new products of this you know you guys FOF fans you might be surprised they change no no they, they are not changing but they catered provide an other choice maybe they like to absorb more different style of collectors different age group collectors and different price range consumers yeah very details yeah so it is a mixture of very authentic details but also a deformed popular designer types so it's a you know I think it's a aggressive touch or trial to have a new series for this really aggressive you know but for myself I like it you know the, the, the hair proportion is really really big enough it looks like it's very cute you know not like other you know similar type of products it looks a bit different you could you could find that in the market there's so many similar type of cute deformed figures you know I, 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 I won't mention the name but you know that yeah very a lot of I think different brands I think more than five brands providing this kinds of deformed style of nice items but this one it looks really different and you could see the hollow this is hollow inside look like the look like in the real games and uh, yeah the painting details you know it's just not like a you know low price item you think of it is still very high quality so I think it worth the price yeah I think this is the new range of serious product it's really different it's really really different so so don't 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 think that it would be a 20 US dollar range product no if it is 20 US dollar range the painting would not be like that no no one effect no highlighting no shadows no different layers or I think nothing with the stand and the special effect of this no only the only the figures and also every single characters have the same gesture same gesture I as I know all the all the characters have different gestures like their FOF statue so I just want to point out how how come it worth the price and how comes uh, how how is the pricing or development strategies of FOF I think I'm thinking of certainly I'm this is only my personal thinking but you know I I am a uh, no um, I cannot say I'm an appropriate person but I could be a one of the person to speak out to point out what is the strategies or uh, pricing logistic what behind this product line they have already calculated and balancing different elements of marketing and pricing strategies I hope this could be a successful series yeah certainly it needs time to, to examine it to prove it but I think this is still really a good choice you know if we just make similar two similar products already in the market how comes I go to buy it so this is not the one this is a very different product in my humble opinion you know you know Artorias you know Dark Souls you know FOF but this kind of figures may be the first time you ever see okay anyway I think I talk enough and I think I move enough for the figures and you know 360 degrees anywhere you know from the bottom from the upper part everywhere I did it and I have to mention that this then it's not including this then it's not including but this base this effect is including in this product anyway this is a um, not a completely flow type but is a production samples so that means the product not released yet and now it's in pre-order stage and if you want to have a look of the real production samples in Hong Kong you could uh, go to the store 7 you know in Hong Kong no you should know that yeah there, there will be a link Facebook link uh, website link behind the videos and you could find the store easily it's in Hong Kong Kowloon 
But if you are not located at Hong Kong, um, my apologies. Um, you have to watch this video or Toys TV video or FOF own official videos and you know Q&A. You will see Alex and Chocos. Yeah, they always there on the videos. Okay, thank you very much for watching. This is episode 53, Figure Talk. Yeah, this is my bad habit. I didn't mention the episode name, the program name. Yeah, my name's Ryan Lowe. Thanks for watching and please, if you like this, please share to your friends. Please like this page and videos. Thank you. See you. Bye bye.